I'm Dave Mason. I'm Michael. And this week's topic is a little bit of a touchy one. It's the topic of what to do about amateur photographers, friends, or family taking photos during the wedding. As always, just communicate with your photographer, gauge their comfort level with there being a second camera, especially if you know it's a friend that's kind of building portfolio material for their own wedding photography business, whether it's amateur or professional. Just express that to your photographer and talk about it because they can probably actually sense that's what's going on and it will relieve a lot of tension just to go ahead and cover it up front and you'd be surprised most of your professionals are going to allow it with just a few stipulations like let me post my professional images first that sort of thing Mike yeah the other um, issue is during the, the formals um, you really in order to make things go as quickly as possible really only want one person taking photos during that um, if your, your guests, when you have 20 people and family members up at the altar and they don't know which camera to look at, it can really slow down the process and that time is always really time sensitive. Yeah, nobody wants to wait an hour and a half for the formals, so like Mike said, um, it's very helpful if there's just one camera for everybody to look at, it will speed things up. Lastly, be conscious during especially the processional. If your photographer um, is seated in the third or fourth pew, they're going to need to lean out to get photos of the bride coming down the aisle. If you're in the pew between that photographer and the bride, make sure you're not doing the same or you're going to be in their shot. So just try and be conscious as a guest at weddings of where you are in relation to the professional and the bride and the groom. If you're aware of that, then in most cases you're going to be able to take your shot and they'll be able to get their shot as well. And lastly, no matter who you are, please don't hold an iPad above your head to take photos during the ceremony. Just trust me on that one and don't do it. Until next time, I'm Dave. I'm Michael. Thanks. I've seen it so many times, and I can't believe the thing is huge that someone would <laughs> not feel entirely conspicuous with this crazy thing on their heads. It's insane.